favorite cups. I've been trying to get more cups that aren't just like clear, <laughs> like something with a little bit more color. This one I got from a store called Mogu Table in Brooklyn. Really like them. Um, but yeah. So I have been a little bit busy with work. I'm actually traveling to California soon, so I'm trying to get a lot of my work done. Also, the heater is on because it is literally like, I think it's like 10 degrees outside. <laughs> um, so I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm going to California, so I do need to start packing. It's actually like in a couple days. Um, so with that, I've been trying to do a lot of work just to like get it over with. Additionally, um, my company's fiscal year is literally as soon as I get back from California. So I just have like have a lot of year end stuff that I need to figure out. So I've been super busy. The longer weekend, this past weekend, um, I did get to do something really fun. Um, so I'll, I'll show you guys that right here. So I have this Riba frame that I got a while ago. The only problem is, is at the old apartment, Henry knocked it down and it cracked the glass. So I haven't really ever used it and I just hate having it around. And I feel like there isn't that much artwork in the apartment. I bought these Lego base panels that are just white. So I'm going to fill this area here with the base plates and then take off the acrylic panel because I just have tons of like little cute Lego pieces from just about like any like any Lego set <laughs> and I just think it'll be fun to stick them on and be able to continuously like move them around. I don't know. It's like an interactive piece that I'm making. So that's that's the craft of the day today. We just saw me make that cute little piece. I don't have anywhere to hang it right now, but it doesn't look that bad, right? I know you can see the seam, but right here I do want to put a block there so that it like really covers it up. I just don't have a block that fits there right now. All my blocks are like little tiny ones. I do want to fill this up, but yeah, I actually really like the way that it came out. The whole idea was to add more color, um, but this is white, so yeah, I'm gonna have to figure it out. Besides that, I did want to show you guys some of the things that I got when I went out the last vlog, um, but I'm holding it off because tomorrow I am potentially going to pick up a new lamp. Um, this lamp here I've had since I've had it since like 2018 um, which isn't that long uh, I either a want to sell it or 
retire it to a different part of the apartment. Like my bedroom doesn't get that much great lighting. Um, so I might move it there, kind of just like move around some of the lights, but I just felt like I wanted something a little bit more interesting here. Um, so yeah, I am gonna go look at it first, um, and then if I like it, we'll get it, and if I don't, then gotta keep looking. I am gonna be probably pretty nitpicky um, just because I've been really big about trying to purchase either a long-term pieces that I will be having for the rest of my life or b pieces that I really like right now that have a good resale value or c things that I need right now that I'm getting for like super cheap like this dining table like free I was considering buying it and then I was just like, ah, oh, I don't know, like I don't want to because so many people in New York have it. And so, honestly, I don't think I was even trying to buy it for more than like 75 bucks. And even then that was like a lot, like maybe like even like 50. Um, but luckily got it free, so. Other than that, I'm not trying to buy any other furniture um, because I just want nice pieces, you know? I'm gonna get back to some work, um, but I will update you, I guess tomorrow it will be, on the lamp. So yeah, I just wanted to check in. We're on our way to pick up the lamp. Hopefully we come back with one. Maybe we won't, who knows. So I didn't do a really good job of recording at all getting the lamp, because I really just took the subway, went to the place, looked at it, picked it up, took an Uber, and brought it straight back. But we just have to rearrange the whole lighting situation around the apartment. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. Let me show you the lamp a little bit better. for a while so I'm really happy with the way this one is um, I think I we're gonna move that one so let's do this <laughs> Otro color antes de volver La gravedad hará desaparecer La arena entre tus dedos No hay una razón para no querer Sentarse bajo el sol y reconocer Que es la mejor sesión para renacer Escuchando tu risa del sol Ahora que todo puede suceder Las nubes cambian tu color de piel Mi cuerpo no cambia de I think it looks so much better. Um, I, I don't know if I'm gonna keep this lamp here. Um, I think I'm gonna maybe take the blankets out and move this little crate below and then maybe I'll move the lamp a little bit back. But I am so happy with it. I was honestly a little bit, uh, not 100% sure, but I think the more I stare at it in the space, it looks really nice. I love. Just like the arch itself, um, I really wanted a little bit more organic shapes in the apartment, so this is really doing it for me. I also wanted to show you guys some new things that I picked up um, when I went out last week. You guys saw that I went back and got the cow plates. I couldn't stop thinking about them. And all the other stuff, it was a little bit too 
yellow or ivory for my personal taste but then there's a little tiny shelf with like these beauties a lot of them were either glazed like this or this i think they also had like a blue one but i just love the size of it i love just like the pill oval shape and i love just like the contrast between the terracotta and this like almost silver mauvey silver color and then additionally this dark gray with this green um i almost feel like it looks like the type of glazing style that Japanese ceramics have, um, although it's not Japanese. So I was really attracted to them, love them. I've been using them really well ever since. Additionally, I recently got this beautiful cup. I only ended up picking up one just because I'm trying to be a little bit more conscious about the amount of cups that I'm purchasing. Um, I actually gifted this in clear uh, for my friend and I just had to get one for myself. But in efforts to have more variety, I got the Storm color um, and I'm obsessed. I'm actually really happy that I got it. I don't have a single cup in this color and this has just been really nice to drink sparkling water out of or just any sort of water. It also has like an opening on the bottom, maybe for, I don't know, but <laughs> very cute. My friends for Christmas got me this really cute Boy Smells candle. This is the Cashmere Kush. Um, it smells so good. I can't really explain what it smells like because I have a really bad sense of smell, but it smells expensive. It also smells like very like perfumey cologne in a really good way. Like I just feel like it make my apartment smell just like very nice. Um, I think it says it has cannabis, flower, cashmere wood, white amber, velveteer, tulip, and powdery musk. So that's this one. I really love it. I haven't gotten myself to like light it yet because I think the packaging is so cute. So maybe I'll get there soon. They also got me this really cute cause coffee table book, which is perfect because I was looking at coffee table books and I just love how like it sections off and I like the imagery and I just like this really unique cover like I think that's also really cool so I've already been displaying it on my shelf and then I just got myself this really cute self-portrait Toshin book uh, you guys already know I have a ton of Toshin books um, I don't know why this one's like so much more special like it has a separate dust cover um, I honestly really got it for the David Hoffney self-portrait I thought it this was so cute, um, but it, it just shows different artists and their self-portrait and I think that's really cool. So I've been displaying this one as well. So those are kind of the recent things that I have gotten in the apartment. Um, so yeah, super fun. So on the new cute little cow plates, um, we are eating some burgers today. I was craving burgers really bad for a while, so uh, we decided to eat out today because we're a little busy. And then we have waffle fries. Um, I think Eric got one with mac and cheese in it. Mine just has onion rings. Um, and then additionally, some fried Oreos. They were doing buy one, get one for a bunch of stuff. So we have extra fries here. But look how cute. Wow, Jenny got pretty close. He didn't even hiss. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is he gonna hit him? <laughs> Yeah.